Hello and welcome back to Here We Tow. Today what I'm going to talk about is our Witter detachable tow bar. When we bought our Sanyong Rexton, we spoke with the manufacturer and we spoke with the dealership to find out what would be the best tow bar to fit to our vehicle. They came back and they told us it'd be the Witter. We went for the detachable one. So what I'm going to do today is I'm just going to show you quickly how we fit it and how we take it off. It's as simple as that. So if you're interested, then please watch us after this. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. What we can be Life with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for So how does the Witter detachable tow bar actually fit? It works as it's already loaded in the position This button here, once that depresses It shoots out the locking part So what that needs to do Is that needs to go into the housing of the car On the cross member That will then hit against the metal which will engage this locking pin. That then will shoot this round, and you should be able to see just here, that will go from red to green. There's nothing there now, but once it's engaged, and I'll show you that. Once that's engaged, so that's depressed, that shoots out the locking part, and then that, is actually on red at the moment, as you can see there, because it's not attached to anything. So that is as simple as it is. So let me stick it on here and I'll show you exactly how this works. To get this back in, if it was to be depressed, because you'd normally leave it in a loaded state in the back of the car so that you can fire it straight into the, uh, into the cross member to be used. If it's like this, all you need to do is, it's exactly the same as if you take it off when it's actually in position on the car press this part in that then twists round that click there locks it into place and that now is ready to fire back into the cross member exactly like this so as you can see there now this has gone green so that means it's locked it's loaded and it's attached nice and firmly. What you can then do is there is a lock that's actually on the side of the tow bar, lock it into position and what that does is that prevents that from being able to be moved so you can't actually physically take that off now. That is now locked to the cross member of the car. To remove it simply unlock it Put your cap back on and then all you do is press so that now goes support it with your other hand twist you'll hear it and feel the click and that is now back in its charged state ready to go back on again the good thing is as well is it's ergonomically designed so when you put your fingers on it you, it actually fits nicely in your fingers as to how the groove is so it always wants to go clockwise so there you go that's how easy it is to fit and remove your witter detachable tow bar from your Sanyon Rexon thank you very much for watching if you do have any comments or questions please hit them in the description below comment link let us know and we'll get them answered for you so I hope you enjoyed that. I hope it helped you. That's exactly what we do. Now it's going to go back in the bag. Thanks very much. See you later.